co-host Eve Nyaga. So what happens when life throws lemons at you? And the song you're just listening to is by one man John Shombo who has had so much lemons thrown at him but he has managed to make something out of them. You can be part of this conversation by sending in your questions, your comments on our social media pages at eCircuit on all social media pages, Instagram, Twitter and on Facebook. Or you can reach me on my social media pages at evenyaga underscore one on Twitter and on Instagram and at Evelyn Nyaga on Facebook. From being in prison to being a street child, he has been through it all and we just want to know how he overcame all these challenges and to inspire someone out there who is going through the same. Welcome John. Thank you so much. How are you today? Fine, thank you. I'm just scared. I'm scared. So um, as you were talking earlier, you told me about some of the things that you went through as a child. Yeah. So I want us to begin a poktok. Akwa, ukiwa mdogo. Nikiwa mdogo. Yes. So how was your childhood growing up? Yeah. Nikiwa mdogo, niseme nimeleleo na single parent, mm -hmm. which is my mother, Joyce Wamboy. Mhm. Mm Niko tukika mahali naitwa Narok. Mhm. Mm and then akakuwa me pass. Mhm. Mm so when she pass, nika have kutoroka mm -hmm. kwa sababu nilianza ku kuteswa na grand hata grandparents walikuwa na ntesa so nikaanza kutoroka kutoka Narok mm -hmm. mpaka Nairobi mm -hmm. and i was nilikuwa mdogo ni same nilikuwa mdogo sana hata singejijua mm -hmm. so kutoka hapo ni street boy mpaka mm -hmm. Nairobi kila mahali kila kona mm -hmm. si mudhuru sio wapi so nimekuwa street hivyo maisha yangu karibu yote mm -hmm. until 2003 mm -hmm. cause can as I remember in 97 ama 96 96 97 mm -hmm. yeah so my shango street until kwa street for how long like how many years says says predict but mm -hmm. almost 7 10 years ah. yeah mm -hmm. so until kitu 204 203 kibaki akasema mm -hmm. watoto wachukuliwe kupeleka rehabilitations because so tunafaa kuwa rehabilitated so hapo ndio nili tulichukuliwa tukapeleka rehabilitations mm -hmm. yeah na hiyo time yote your mother was not looking for you mm -hmm. ama wewe haukutaka kujua vile nimekuambia hapo before my, mm -hmm. my my parent had pass oh, by yeah. my mother okay, so up to date zai ona baba yangu mm -hmm. yeah so as well. help me understand yeah. ali pass time yenye ulitoka nyumbani yeah yeah tulikuwa tushamzika mm -hmm. tulimzika na rock so nikaavu tukaavu kuni mm -hmm. nikaavu kutoroka mm -hmm. yeah okay Yes. So there was no one who could take care of you kutoka nyumbani ndio maana uli decide kukuja Nairobi. Yeah, tulikuwa nilikuwa na rusho kama mpira niko kwa aunt yangu. Mhm. Mm na rusho kwa gukangu. Hivi tu yani hakuna watu wanatakia mm -hmm. kwa wengi naona my cousins and our relatives wengine wakipo kipeleka watoto shule mm -hmm. but mimi siendi shule. Mm -hmm. So ikani ya changamoto sana mm -hmm. na nika make decision kutoroka. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So wao kutoku kuchunga vizuri ndio ilifanya ukatoroka kutoka nyumbani. Kabisa. Mhm. Mm yeah. So when you got into the street ulikuwa ka unatoa wapi I know what was streets mm. like chakula um, place ya kulala ulikuwa una survive aje Cuz survive kwangu ni sema okay nilikuwa na fever cuz eh, nilikuwa naona watu watu wananipenda mm -hmm. so nikiomba once inaitangwa kuduru na nje nyingine ni kiduru mm -hmm. so siko na kosa pesa yangu kidogo mm -hmm. and then kuna mama walikuwa na nifeva wenye wanauza soko mm -hmm. so watanipea matunda masaya jioni asubuhi akifungua soko mm -hmm. so sikuwa na kosa kitu ya kukula but pale pa kulala ndio shida na mibi kwa mparas na kanjo mm -hmm. na mambo kama hizo nilikuwa nimeshashiko mara kadhaa nikipeleka ngo police station tena naona mtoto ni mdogo na niachilia nishapelekwa mm -hmm. approved na achiliwa kwa nini ulikuwa how, how old were you Sizi sizi elezea kabisa kwa siku hata na siku anajijua mm -hmm. mzuri. Mhm. Mm yeah, kwa sababu hata nilikuwa tu mdogo acha niseme. So when you're living in the streets yeah. um drugs inaingilia uko in between um kuiba vitu kama hizo. Hizo yeah, ulikuwa na deal na vitu kama hizo aje na uliingia in drugs at one point ama kuiba vitu kama hizo. Okay niseme tulianza na kitu kama karata. Mm -hmm. Karata ndio ilianza kunini cause nilikuwa napenda karata. Nacheza hizi simbi kadi. Mm -hmm. So hapo ndio nilikuwa nahitaji pesa. 
Mm -hmm. e, alafu bado nataka kuvuta gum. Mm -hmm. Sema mosti nilikuwa natumia tu gum sana mm -hmm. na sigara. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So nikiwa mdogo hiyo. Nikiwa mdogo tu. Yeah, hakuna mtu atakuuliza. So, ni kitu common kwa street children. Yeah, niki wacha niseme ni kitu common. Mm -hmm. But hawa kubwa sijui wanaona ga tu hawezi kuuliza kwa sababu ni one blood. Mm. So unless mtu mwingine akuje akuambie but sisi wenyewe tushazoeana. Mm. Yeah, so nilikuwa na struggle sana kunini kwa ku, kuingia kutoka kwa hiyo karata but najipata ni kwa hapo. So wakati sasa pesa imeanza kukosekana mm. na kama up na idea nyingine ya ku, mm -hmm. kudanganya mtu ama kumuibia mm -hmm. bado ni kwa mdogo. Mm -hmm. But the more nazidi ku grow, mm -hmm. the more sana anaanza kujua wizi. Mm -hmm. Ku ku saa. Ah. Yeah, kulikuwa na ile ya kofia. Uh -huh. Kulikuwa na ile wazo walikuwa naweka pesa hapa. <laughs> <laughs> eh kulikuwa na bahasha watu walikuwa wamezoeka mm. pesa kwa bahasha. Mm. Kakuja mpaka ngeta. Really? Yeah, so. Uh -huh. Ukuroidi mpaka ikafika mahali sasa nikakuwa hodari. Mhm. So tunaweza. Hodari wa ku kuhasa. Hodari wa ku idea. Mhm. Yeah, cuz nafika sana sana mahali ni tu tunapanga line tu. Mm. Nini mnapanga line? Mm. So tukua tu kama vijana watano. Mm kipita kwa hiyo kona mm. kama askari venye wanaambianga kaini hapa chini au mm. mnaambia so, wakae chini eh, kae chini kibeti uh -huh. na simu na pesa kando mm -hmm. kaa chini simu na pesa kando mm -hmm. yeah snatching by this snatching ndio ilikuwa imeniingia sana especially wakati simu zilikuja mm -hmm. so kiona tu simu ni kusnatch alafu god amenipatia talents mingi mm -hmm. so mbio unge anishika <laughs> kwa na na mister zango ni mzoto anapatikana uh -huh. but mimi nilikuwa naponia yeah uh -huh. That is that is quite something. Yeah. Uh -huh. yeah. So um, after all those things, yes. ilikuwa hiyo ni kitu necessary lazima ufanye so that you can continue living, si ndio? Ni kabisa. Uh -huh. yeah. And um unajua ukianza sasa ukiingia kwa life ya wizi, yeah. unaenda tu eventually because I have read stories ama nimeona stories maybe online. Yeah. Mtu alianza tu kama street child, anaenda tu aki graduate, anaenda aki graduate. Eventually utashikwa. Wewe ilifika point ukashikwa. Eh pia mimi nilifika point nikashikwa but mi, before nishikwe acha niseme nilikuwa nilikuwa najionea watu wakikufa hmm. bise zangu hata na uliota nyingine tunaenda kumuokoa tu hivi na wako miaka ngapi hawa wenye wanauliwa wadogo sana age ndogo ikienda sana ni 16 years wow yeah hmm. so wakakuwa na pigo risasi wanauliwa so mi kuna wakati nilishikwa nikapelekwa approved juu ya karata hmm. nilikuwa na 14 years hmm. so nikaambia until nifikishe 18 years hmm. So huko nilikaa tu 3 month peke yake mm -hmm. nikatoroka. Yes, nikatoroka. Yes, nikakuja nikatoroka. Mm -hmm. Siati kutoka kutoroka. <laughs> so wakati nilikuja nikarudi tena rehabilitation. Mm -hmm. Waka nikataka kwa sababu ya misbehaving. Mm -hmm. Lafu, Ulikuwa na misbehave ukiwa huko kwa rehab. Eh, huko bado kwa rehab na Why? misbehave. Eh, Acha niseme tu ni damu ilikuwa hivyo. Mm -hmm. Na ili take time kwa sababu hata sikuwa nimemaliza class 8. Mm -hmm. Nilikuwa class 6 nikiyo hiyo 14 years. Mm -hmm. So shule karibu zote zini nikata. It's only one school in Ito Uhuru Primary School. Mm -hmm. Kwa samu ya in Makadara. Mm -hmm. Waka nikubali. So nilirudi class, class 5, sorry. Class mm -hmm. 5 up to class 8, 10. Na so, sayu usha pisha mea kafuti. Eh, nisha zeka zeka. Mm -hmm. So nakana watu hii hapo. Mm -hmm. So tina kumaliza shule. Nikurudi tena kuanza tena mamambo na ukua. Mm -hmm kuinje tena. Njoo kuna mtu mwenye anaku anakushughulikia. Ananishughulikia. Mm. So nika decide hiki tu sipo. Nikaona ni mzuri nianze kuuza nguo. Mhm. Mm so nikarudia. Hiyo ndio kitu ilikuwa ndio kwa hiyo. Kwa mimi I'm, I'm favored nikiuza kitu mm -hmm. inaenda. Alafu yeah. mimi nilikuta tu nikaa niko designer tu mm. bila tu kusomea kwa sababu mm. navalisha mtu mpaka aniambie kitu watu ukikuja nao mpya niambie. Niambie. Mhm. So ikafika mahali tena niko 50-50 na na uko na zangu wapi niko na toa kikomba mm -hmm. na uzo uko bahati oh, kwa yeah. street tu ama ulikuwa na nilikuwa na kaa bahati nilikuwa na nyumba sorry mm -hmm. yeah. okay uh -huh. so kushiko kwangu ni seme nilishiko pia nikitoka tu kikomba mm -hmm. na ilikuwa ni kitu saa nane saa nane mchana kuna scene of crime inaendelea mahali naito majengo mm -hmm. e, ukitokea na madi, nini mm, majengo ukitokea kwa bridge ya isili mm -hmm. so that uingie upande ya bahati mm -hmm. so mimi sikujua nini inaendelea but nilifanya tu kupita so nikakuta askari wamejaa but sikujua ni askari so hapo ndio nili nilistukia tu nimeambiwa kaa chini ai yeah umeambiwa tu kaa chini hiyo njia hata ilikuwa na mtu kuna mm -hmm. mtu anapita ilikuwa sanga pita imenipata sana mchana, mchana. mchana. 
And there were no people na, around. Na juu scene of crime ina endelea so askari wa mefukuzo watu wote hiyo yeah. njia. So misi kuwa na understand. Sijui ni vile nikuwa ni mevuta. Unajua mm -hmm. pia nilikuwa na tumia bado. Mm -hmm. And uh, kabla niache, kusemi niache, kabla niache kufuta marijuana hili ni take time. Mm -hmm. And uh, hili nifikia plesu. So bado ukifanya hii biashara yu nilikuwa still. Na, eh, sana nilikuwa ni meacha almost kila kitu na tumia tu marijuana peke mm -hmm. yake. Na ilikuwa na mpaka hili fika place ni kalia. And uh, ilifanya ni ka fast. Ndiyo ni hache ikitu. Mm -hmm. yeah. mm -hmm. So hapo ndiyo niliambio keti chini. Nikona tu askari wa mikuja mungi alikuwa mevaa jacket ya coca cola Nini wakakucha wengi sana kama wanane Kitu wali niulizo niuliza unaitu waji ni kawambia minaito shomba Na kuna askari mmoja na nijua alikuwa naito mambling Kuna mm. mungina naito ago mame ya nuwa nijua mm. So alikuwa minaimbea tumeku kataza mara mingi kupita inji ya sindio mm. Na ni ukwele alikuwa minikataza ni sabudu kupita inji ya kwa zio inji ya kuna crime mingi sana Walikuwa so, nakujua jua kuwa mno tori ya sabaka Eee eh, walikuwa na nijua <laughs> Mm. But sasa nilikuwa nime, nime change maka na uzia bibi ya hawa, askari nguo mm, yeah. So lata nabiyo askari nilikuwa na muzia nguo mm. And then ni kama tu ilikuwa imepango na mwenyezi mungu ikuwa hivyo mm -hmm. So at the point kuyo jama mwenye alikuwa na tafuto alikuwa mejificha mahali kwa za alikuwa shaha pigo risasi mm. So wakati risasi li, lizidi kumuma mm. alitokea mm. So wakati alitokea na kulikuwa na, kulikuwa na askari wengi sana civilians mm. So ilibidi ya meuliwa. Mm. Lipigo risasi almost. Niseme tu kama zaidi ya mia. Lipigo mingi za aramia. Na uu liku unangalia tu. Haami nilikuwa mbali kidogo. So wali oh. nipeleka police post. Uh -huh. Nikakaa hapo. Until... Kwa nini waka kupeleka police post na wewe si. You are not part of the crime. So, niseme tu. Siezi sema ani finye kulienda. But wali sema tu uu jamati ya nilimsalimia. Tulisalimia ati, uyu mwenye ali. Hati wali niona, mm -hmm. tukio huko mbali ni kimsalimia. Wakati ya walikuwa na mfuata. Na ulikuwa memsalimia? Ni hata si mjui, si kuwa imuona. Kwa sababu hata malikuwa ni mefungiu, si kumuona na macho. Hmm. Bata lileto tu watu wakipiga nduru na raya. Hmm. Ya. Yeah. So askari, inspectors kutoka kila kitengo walikuja. Wakani piga mapicha, wakani book. Hata walikuwa mesema kijana tunambook. Hmm. So wakimanisha kukubuku, wanamanisha wapi unaenda unaenda <laughs> eh okay yeah mm -hmm. so hapo ndio niliuliza tu god nitakufa nikiwa mdogo hivi mhm mm kulikuwa miaka ngapi hiyo time nilikuwa 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 nishafikisha 18 oh. but niliuliza mungu wa ushuhuda bado ulikuwa mdogo eh niliuliza mungu nitakufa nikiwa mdogo hivi that was uh, november 2014 mhm mm yeah so ndio nikapelekwa nikapelekwa eh, shauri moja police station mhm mm kaandika statement Wakaandika vitu zao, nikakalisho kukuka kama tatu And then nikapeleko mpaka in Australia prison mm -hmm. yeah. So lika how long in prison? Prison nili serve two good years mm -hmm. Yeah for nothing For nothing, yeah. kwa sababu you are not part of that crime Any time I go to the court mm -hmm. Nikwena lilia you are on and I want to share Ah watu wakujangi But ukweli how kwa ikuja ata siku moja mm -hmm. complainer mm -hmm. Neither witness Arresting officer, hakuna mtu walia ikuja. Lakini ya wakutoi bado. Eh, saa wakutoi, wanakupadia, wana, wana, wanasema mga wacha tupatia time. Mm -hmm. Until he reach time, wakasema nafaa kuwachiliwa. Mm -hmm. Although, eh, investigation nini, mkiongozo wa master ka alikuwa na kana. Hakuwa mm. eh, nataka wachiliwa. Hakuwa nataka ni achiliwa, nasema, unajua hivu ndi wanakuwaga, hindi wakazi yake. Mm. So, judge eh, alishiko na, na roi ingine, mm -hmm. haka ni achiliwa na section 87A, eh, mm -hmm. ambayo ina maanisha hao ukiachiliwa still unaweza fort within 24 hours uh -huh. na urudisho tena kesi yanze upya uh -huh. kama kuna eh, kuna 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 ushahidi tena nyingine inaweza oh, kuwa iko kiko na witness yeah. tena mm -hmm. so life yako in prison how was it too hard too hard <laughs> not as hard too hard cuz kukula ni shida mhm mm watu kutembelea ni shida hakuna nguo mm -hmm. kwanza mwaka ya kwanza mm -hmm. nili struggle sana mm -hmm. until the reach time nikasema hey I need to be born again. Mm -hmm. So nikapatizi wa jela, mm -hmm. nikokokea jela, mm -hmm. nikasomea huko e mouse Bible Studies, nikapata mm -hmm. diploma na tu certificate. And then sasa milangu wangu kanza kufunguka, nikanza kupata mabeste wanakuja wana niangalia. Mm -hmm. Mabeste wa gani from eh, what you kuna jua before? Eh, from mm -hmm. unye tukuna hao before. Mm -hmm. unye tukuna Wale unye mbuliko mlakana wa kwa street? Eh, Pia wa si kwa before. street. Uh -huh. Sasa ni kio rehab. Sorry. Ok, oh yeah. Eh, yeah. So but we have kutoka rehab, mm -hmm. tuka kumbua kanyumba juli hivi mianza. So nilikuwa na perform hapo kawash, hapo ndio nilikuwa na pata riziki. Mm -hmm. Mali naito kabaridi kawash. Mm -hmm. yeah, so hapo ndio nilikuwa na pata kitu yangu kidogo. Mm -hmm. So hapo ndio nilikuwa na so, kuja kuniangalia. Okay. Yeah. Um, 
umesema uli, uli, uliokoka ukiwa in prison yeah. is it something ulifanya out of zile shida zenye unapitia ama ni wanasema anga ni calling yeah. ulisikia at that point lazima uko yes. okay yes mm -hmm. nilisikia cuz nilikaa chini nikajiuliza sina mama sina baba mm -hmm. sina relatives sina mtu wote ambaye ananijua mm -hmm na ukweli nikiangamia hapa ni shida sana mm. so niliona tu acha nipatie god life yangu endi ya kuwe parent yangu mm -hmm. rafiki yangu ya kuwe kila kitu mm -hmm. so hapo ndio mambo ilianza kuchipuka nikakuwa na, na niko acrobatic mm -hmm. i'm good in acrobatic bado ukiwa in jail eh, ni kio angel mm -hmm. nikakuwa dancer niko poa sana dancing nikakuwa sana music alafu then nikakuwa ni mini pasta mm -hmm. na ubiri so wakati uko na hizo vitu ukiona hizo vitu ukiwa jela mm -hmm. so utaavu kutitio poa kidogo kama mm -hmm. chakula yako itakuwa special kidogo <laughs> eh kasabuni unakuwa unaletewa sasa zingine <laughs> kwa ukikuwa na kitu yote wageni wamekuja mm -hmm. utakuwa priority ya yeah. mm -hmm. so at least ili nifanya nikuwe na level ya kukaa mzuri kidogo though mm -hmm. niko jela bado mm -hmm. so ukakuwa na ile favor mm -hmm. yeah so ulisema we'll ulitoka after 2 years after 2 years mm -hmm. ndio mimi natoka eh so ulifanya nini after kutoka jela kutoka jela nilikuwa confused sana cuz hata nguo kubadilisha sina mm -hmm. sina mahali pa kukaa and then nime change stuck mm -hmm. mambo sasa oh yeah uli uli, uli amo badilisha ku change totally ku change so ile company yangu ama wale mabest wangu mm -hmm. na feel vibaya kuacha na na feel vibaya kukaa nao kwa sababu mm -hmm. still wana smoke Oh, eh, yeah, unajua kuna wale wame, umefika mtu nakuliza ni aje mm -hmm. Utakula mugoka, mm -hmm. utakunywa mm -hmm. eh, So unawaza kuona, si hapo nilikuwa nataka na masivi nataka mm -hmm. Kwa kitu yote mzuri lazima ipigwa Hata mti, nani ya hikona matunda inatupi hey, ya Unaipiga ndo matunda ziti ya mke Saa, so hivu ndo ikakua But nilikaa nao until Ikafika place, so nikamua nisonge mm -hmm. But nili struggle cause Nilifika time bado nilikuwa na, na peer pressure na nimerudia ku smoke tena marijuana mm -hmm. na unasema hawa watu wenyewe walikuwa na smoke yeah. wanakula mogo kana hizo vitu ni watu bado walikuwa rehab eh, so tuseme hiyo rehab si ati inawasaidia 100% ama hiyo ni option ni choice yako kukuwa ni choice yako unajua okay watu wanaweza kupea uh, ni advice but the okay advice inaweza kuwa millions but decision wa gani moja wewe ndio mm -hmm. utamake it mm -hmm. na hiyo ndio itakusaidia maita kufungulia njia mm -hmm. so me decision ili make nikaona hapana cuz tumekuwa rehabilitated ya kutosha mm -hmm. na imefika mahali unafaa ku decide so nika make decision na nikaamua sasa nimeamua na nikaamua ku change mm -hmm. yeah and after ulitoka ulitoka jela yeah. do you feel like watu wanatoka jela wana ku accepted kwa community tena ama so, watu wanao treat like ai ah huyo atufai kwa associates na yeye <laughs> hapo ndio kazi iko sasa mm -hmm. kabla juu wakati nilikuwa na kana ama best wangu cuz nyumba tuna share waki miss place kitu kama simu ama ipote mm -hmm. ilikuwa tu ah shomba please ni wewe tu umechukua aki ustoke jela tena ulete hizi tabia huku so inakuwa na kutocha any time kitu yote kifanyika mpaka askari anakuuliza umebadilika akipata hatu na wewe mbele ya watu mm. uliacha hiyo tabia mm. ama bado unaiba sasa watu wanakusikiza wanaona hayo so watu wanakuogopa kila mahali so ikakuwa ni ngumu sana kukubalika na society mm -hmm. unless ufanye kitu yenye mm -hmm. utakubali mm -hmm. umechange mm -hmm. that's why nikaamua ku decide sasa acha nianze muziki mm -hmm. nikakuwa na preach cuz naendaga kikomba na mm -hmm. preach kikomba all over wananijua mm -hmm. naendaga tomboya street na mm -hmm. preach hapo wananijua so nawafanyia muziki wanajua mm -hmm. so at least hiyo ndio ilifanya kwa at least close mm -hmm. so ni struggle ku get back kwa watu ku accept kwa community kubwa tena. sana kubwa mm -hmm. sana yeah. um, so muziki yako um, ulianza lini eh, muziki tuseme nilianza hiyo 2015 nikiwa ndani mhm mm mm, nikaanza nikakuwa ninaimba tu nawaimbia twin mates ninawaimbia and then kaona wananikubali wana, wana kabisa mm -hmm. na hata mimi nika feel kabisa hii kitu ni ukweli ni talent so kuna wakati mmoja wakati nilitoka nilipatana na Jaguar eh akanipeleka main switch production mm -hmm. so nika record wimbo wangu ya pili kabla ya kuanza ya mm -hmm. nataka nilipatana na yeye ukiwa huko nikiwa nikiwa nje sasa mm -hmm. so nika record ya main switch wimbo inaitwa nataka and then hiyo ya kwanza pia nilipatana na Felo ya uh, umo umoja mm -hmm. ende nilifanyia na all this nimefanyia tu free mm -hmm. So nilikuwa na furai sana until sasa man niliamua ni struggle at least nijifanyie ka video juu video ndio waga ni shida ni pesa, pesa eh, na ni shida 
So hapo ndio nili struggle kale ka kitu nilikuwa nako mm-hmm. nibidi ni change change niuze ndio nifanye mm-hmm. video ni kitu gani ulikuwa nayo after eh ni sema acha ni sema ni siri mm-hmm. lakini nilikuwa na kitu ambao ni halali eh yeah. oh ilikuwa ni halali mm-hmm. <laughs> nikauza <laughs> Ano, yeah. kuna time uliniambia ulikuwa na nyumba ulikuwa nayo yeah, kwa hiyo ndio kitu mmesema oh, usha oh, mm-hmm. eh. mm. <laughs> <laughs> okay um, so umesema mlipata na jago akakufanyia music akakusaidia akanisaidia na mm-hmm. audio recording yeah. Yeah. so hizo ni ngoma za kitambo uh-huh. Uh-huh. si ni mbili tu uh-huh. za 2017 mm-hmm. 18 but hazina video hizo moja iko na video ambayo ni ya jela jela uh-huh. and then sasa hiyo ana inaitwa nataka mm-hmm. so hiyo ina video but kuna producer ambaye anaitwa Felo mm-hmm. eh ako and ako and me so eh ndio niko and eh mm-hmm. so kuna vile tunafaa kuifanya within all this next month oh, or this so month so you are yeah. still working on it yeah. so currently unafanya nini kusaidia kujibus kutafuta pesa Kitu, eh, uliacha ile life ingine nyumba mm. lazima sasa hii ufanye kitu legal yenye itakutafutia pesa kabisa so mimi nenda ku preach mm-hmm. na hapo ndio napata saa zingine daily bread saa zingine nikiona ni, ni kazi kutoka huko mpaka jukoz nilihamia banana mm-hmm. kabla nitoke banana ni kuja mpaka huko ina ni have ku ku, ku, ku deal na simu mm-hmm. So mtu ananiambia niaje soon to mile ngoma yako anantumia 50 bob so mm-hmm. ah eh cuz watu wanaipenda mm-hmm. so hapo ndio mimi upata ndo yangu mm-hmm. whatsapp mm-hmm. mtu ananiambia nataka na mtumia mm-hmm. ananipeata kama ni, anantumia na mpesa mm-hmm. so mimi usi leave muziki yangu na saa zingine mimi naenda kaosh mm-hmm. nikiwa na saa zingine maybe mambo imekuwa ngumu juu pale wajanifukuza yeah cuz niko na kadi tuko registered yeah. in, in, uh, government ile certificate yetu mm-hmm. so nikitoa tu kadi yangu anajiunga ni mimi na hakuna mtu ataniuliza mja nichukue hata kama ni so mbili ama so tatu mm-hmm. narudi mpaka banana mm-hmm. so na save hiyo dopo la pole mm-hmm. juu ya management yote nyingine zatokea okay yeah. so life yako ime change like 100% ni same 99.9 99% tu <laughs> <laughs> so what about mm-hmm. wale watu ulikuwa nao before wale nilikuwa nao before mimi watembea kwa street kwa street kwa sorry. rehab uko jela eh watu watu mimi upata nao mostly ni sehemu ni watu wa jela cuz naenda ga in Australia mhm nishaenda na preach huko naenda ka kuwatembelea na peleka tissues sabuni mm-hmm. eh kuna mwingine natembelea anga kwa kamiti maximum mm-hmm. so kuna wale na wajali tu but mm-hmm. sisi sema watu watu wote but kuna ule 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 tutapelekea huyu mwingine ni huyu mhm mm, naenda ka niwahubiria So na kwa pata hii testimony yangu kwa mm-hmm. wakati wananiona mm-hmm. they feel that ukweli mtu anaweza toka na change. Yeah, eh na kulingana na vile walikuwa wananijua na vile life ilikuwa huko. Mm-hmm. So what to change sana uh, the last time nilikuwa it was uh, Sunday mwisho ya last month. Mm-hmm. Ulikuwa umeenda kwa tembea kwa kwa huko na church uh, na, na shiriki church ni Tago City Valley Road. Mm-hmm. So tukio mission tulienda huko. Mm-hmm. So wako wanajua kama hii ndio prison ilikuwa yeah. but niliwaambia wakati tulifika. Mm-hmm. So wakanipatia chance mimi ndio nampatia na the minister. Mm-hmm. So hapo 21 people wali get born again mm-hmm. and then niseme watu walifurahia. Mm-hmm. Ya yeah, juu niliwaimbia, kawapreachia. Na wanaona hiyo testimony. Na wanaona hiyo testimony. Eh, uh, inawapatia uh, encouragement. Uh, Is it acha tuseme unajua mtu kuishi kwa streets. Uh, most of the time yeah. ama 100 unaenda tu kipotea. Umeona watu kama hao wenyewe wameenda wakipotea kabisa. Eh hey, watu wamepotea wengi wengi cuz nasema wakati tulikuja ama mm-hmm. wakati nilitoroka tulikuja tukiwa watano. Na it's only mimi naonaga na si ati najisifu ama najifurahia sana. Mm-hmm. But tunaonanga tu nikawa mimi ndio nilikubali change. Mm-hmm. Wengine walikufa marisasi, wengine walikufia Mombasa. Wengine wali sisi sema but mostly walikufa. Mm-hmm. Eh yeah, wengine hata walipotea kupotea kabisa kwa sababu wengine sasa ni dawa tu unaona tu ako alive but eh yeah, spiritual unaona tu amekufa kwa sababu mm-hmm. hakuna vile anaweza toka kwa drugs. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Kuna necessity ya ku, u, 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 kuna necessity ya ku take these drugs ukiwa 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 kwa street. Kwa nini mna, kwa nini watu wana take these drugs? Ndio at least tuone 
ndioone uko yani ni kama mtu mtu so uwezi fanya kitu ulikuwa tu wengi usema uwezi fanya kitu uwezi kaa soba tu watu wewe uwezi kwa utumii kitu utumii utumii but mm-hmm. unaona kwa kila mtu ana ana wazimu yake ama kila mtu ana mambo yake mm-hmm. so lazima wewe pia ukue kiwewe ndio at least mkue level ama ukue unaweza kuwa na si mm-hmm. chani sema kitu kama hiyo okay. yeah mm-hmm. cuz bila hiyo kanyagiwa chini mm-hmm. yeah and um nataka sasa tuongelee hiyo song yako tukimalizia eh. um watu wame receive aje hiyo song eh watu wengi sana wana receive passionate mm-hmm. uh-huh, sema mostly wanaambia naenda far wengine wanaambia una touch watu wengi sana cuz kama saa hii wacha tuseme saa hivi ni wabunge wetu ama viongozi wetu wanakula billions of money mm-hmm. na hakuna mali wanapeleka na akipeleka kotini it's only 100,000 and it is shwama 1 million out of one billions of money na anatoka na unamuona nje but mse kama mimi nikienda pale ni kule na si nitoke bila kulipa mhm naweza umia sana na naumia sana na 99% mm-hmm. na kupatia assurance mhm hawa tuko jela mm-hmm. ni very and innocent mm-hmm. very innocent mm-hmm. kuna kitu unakuwa amefanya na kesi yake inaweza kuata ni, ni ya kuisha tu within no month mm-hmm. but anarukishwa na rukishwa hata serve 10 years mm-hmm. in prison kesi yake ijaisikika mwingine mm-hmm. hata baadaye anakuja na fungo 10 years mm-hmm. ni kitu hakuna mm-hmm. so ni sema nilitunga hii song so that at least government na mtu yote ambaye anafanya crime mm-hmm. na mtu yote ambaye anaweza fikiria kufanya crime aisikizie na afikirie sana mm-hmm cuz nilitunga nikisema jela ni jeraha kwa ule mtu ana uwezo mhm kweli lakini ule uko na uwezo kuna watu wanakaa poa sana na kujela mm-hmm. hata watoka angi hataki kutoka mhm kwa sababu wako poa mhm eh anafeel kama home but wewe mwenye una uwezo kabisa ni painful yeah cuz freedom always in unaona kitu yote au hizi kabisa yeah so nataka uambie watu wanaweza pata Jason yeah wa share yeah. ama wakupate wewe mwenyewe for inspiration minist- ministry Okay, mimi mwenyewe siko kwa mtandao sana but Facebook mm-hmm. najulikana kama John Shomba. Ya yeah, na maybe song yangu vile unaweza ipata tu peke yake. Kama unataka mimi mwenyewe nikutumie, naweza kutumia na maybe naweza pia na namba yangu ya simu. Mm-hmm. That is 07 ukitaka ni kuje kwa church ni wapatie minister ku minister kuhubiri kuwapatia ujumbe wote tu mm-hmm. unanipata